All right, thank you, Nicholas. I want you to take a look at your screen. Whatever you're doing, stop and look at this. This is a map showing both the westbound lanes of I-10 near mile marker 56. That's about three miles east of the Wilcox Road exit on I-10 westbound. The Alabama Law Enforcement Agency, or ALEA, tells Fox 10 News that the lanes were blocked for a long time and have since been reopened now following a two-vehicle crash that involved a pedestrian that was hit. The condition of the pedestrian is unknown right now. Now, once we do get that information, we'll pass it along to you. But again, the road is open.